Hi there and welcome to a new SketchUp rendering tutorial using the rendering program RRender Next. So today I'm going to teach you all the ins and outs of the uh, color render mode which is one of the RRender Next features. Clay rendering is one of the features uh, which is part of the color mode rendering tutorial and uh, clay rendering is mainly used to show the detail of your model without adding colors or textures and this feature renders the sketch model in black and white and you can set up a clay rendering as follows go over here to the setup options you can also reach that by uh, clicking the green render button over here and click on the load options button then go all the way down here to NXT and then uh, here you see color rendering mode and you see normal clay gray no, no texture and color no texture normal will make sure that you'll render with exactly the same colors and textures as you've created it in SketchUp and it will turn out very realistic with clay rendering uh, you'll yeah, get a clay rendered image which has several uh, advantages because it's very simple and uh, it will not uh, uh, distract the shape of your model therefore because there will not be any textures or colors which will really uh, make it able uh, to uh, really focus on the model and it really brings out every detail in the model in a good way so here you see uh, one of those uh, clay rendered models uh, which this is the clay rendered model which I've created from uh, the model which you just saw and as you can see um, yeah you really see the shape of the building in a really good way and you don't see any colors or textures which I've added um, so as you saw that was very easy to do simply make sure that you select the one in uh, the load options area or the setup options area and then uh, just click the green render button maybe add any changes which you want to have uh, next to these uh, clay render settings but that's basically it another option is the uh, gray mode uh, which means that there are no textures and the color is grayscale you again have to go to the uh, setup options go to NXT or next and then click the one right to the clay one which is gray no texture and then you have to click the green render button and it will start rendering but there's something you still have to change over here uh, opposed to the different one uh, the, clay, uh, the clay rendering which we just did which was done all by itself so here we are and as you can see uh, the image uh, of our model has been rendered but as you can see there are no textures and the colors which are still in the image are just the colors of the textures but the textures are not there anymore and furthermore um, yeah it's not black and white as you can see and this is gray mode so therefore uh, you still have to change the saturation so by doing that you have to go to the tone operator which is this button over here uh, and then you have to go all the way down over here where the saturation is right now 100 but we can turn that down and if you turn it to zero you'll see that a gray a white black and white or kind of gray tone image has been created so if you now click close you'll have a, a gray tone image um, with without textures and without color uh, but still you uh, really see the shape of uh, the model that you've created in a really good way so uh, therefore this is quite useful so the last feature of this color mode is the feature to create uh, an image in color without textures so color only and therefore also full uh, saturation so in order to create that we are back in the setup options over here and we go to the last one color slash or, or dash no texture and then we click on the red render button and this is what will be created if you finish the rendering and of course you will not have to change the saturation here because you want to see the colors that are in the model so a uh, no tone operation this time so that's basically everything you need to know for this tutorial i hope you found it useful and you now know how to make a, a clay rendered image and uh, like a different rendered image like uh, the gray tone image or just uh, any image without the actual textures of the model in there um, yeah, I would advise to just play around with it a little bit, uh, check out what will give you the best impression of the design which you've created and whether that's with black and white images or whether that's with color or without textures or with textures, that's something that you'll have to find out yourself 
but I think in this way you'll be able to uh, figure out how to um, yeah create these uh, color render mode images so um, yeah I hope you enjoyed and um, yeah found this video useful and also I hope to see you back in another tutorial which I've created for iron and next so far I've created quite a good playlist already uh, which will give you very much information on what this program works like so if you'd like to learn more about that check out the playlist on my channel um, but anyways thanks for watching this and i hope to see you back later